Hey folks, today is Thursday, July 11th, and it's day 21 of the HCG program. It's been a couple of days since I checked in. The twins have been really sick, so it's been really hard for me to kind of get the time to kind of just settle in and talk to you guys. Uh, to give you an update, I went in for a check-in this week on Tuesday, which was probably about 19 days uh, into the program. I didn't lose a pound. I was still 255. Um, and even though I was kind of crestfallen about the whole situation, apparently the fact that I had just come off of my cycle plays a huge role. And so in fact, the doctor says if you have a week where you don't lose any weight, usually it's because you're backed up and you're not taking enough shits or it's water rate gain from your cycle. So he told me not to worry about it, just to keep moving and that I should probably see a substantial loss when I go in next week. So that's kind of what I'm aiming for. I mean, I did cheat a little bit, but I really didn't cheat any more than I had the previous weeks where I was still losing eight or nine pounds. So I'm going to chalk this one up to the woman goods and just hope that next week I go, I can be down at least another 10 pounds. I would love to be 240 by the time I'm done with this because 240 is the smallest I've been in my adult life and I was that weight actually right when I got pregnant with the twins. Well, I think I was that when I went for my first weigh-in at five weeks, I was 238 and I think that's the smallest on record for me like ever um, since I became an adult. So I'm really excited to maybe actually be able to get down to that weight or close to it by the time I end the 30 days of HCG. Uh, so that when I do my rest period and go on the Medifast, which is the prepared meals for 30 days, hopefully I can lose maybe another 20 and then maybe just start the summer, the fall off 50 pounds lighter than I was two months prior. And then seeing, depending on how much weight I lose then, maybe I'll go on the HCG for another 30 days. I'm not sure. Um, HCG is hard as shit. Um, I really like variety in my food and I think that the biggest thing for me is that I'm just not excited about eating because I'm eating the same things. But this is not to say that maybe I can't find some more creative ways to do stuff. So we'll just kind of see how that goes. But I'll kind of give you a little glimpse of what's going on with the bod. Um, I'm really feeling like I'm seeing most of my weight loss right here. I'm actually kind of caving in, which is rare. I am wearing a girdle right now, so it is a bit exaggerated. But I act my hand actually goes in right here. I am losing weight right here. I can tell because there's literally like, and I'm not going to show you because I'm just not that confident yet, but there's areas where the skin, where where the fat is melting and it's the skin's actually puckering up there because it's like it's, sh it's sh shrinking. And I'm seeing that actually in quite a few areas. They're just areas where it's just kind of shrinking upwards. It's kind of hard to explain, but again, if I ever get bold enough and decide to uh, introduce you into the world of my fat rolls, I'll actually show you what it looks like, but I'm just not feeling that bold right now. So that's pretty much the biggest thing is I really feel I'm losing most of it here. I feel like since I carried most of my weight here, that's going to take the longest to go away, but I am excited about this because like I said, I'm starting to have a little bit of shape and that's really exciting for me. So um, again, I've, I've lost a lot of weight on my back and you can see the way this dress is just kind of big right there it used to be tight but now let me get a little closer but now you can see it just kind of hangs a little bit because there's not as much back fat holding it up back there so uh, in general you know I'm really excited but again I'm in this for the long haul and like I said I would really love to be able to go back next week and find out I'm down to like 245 or 240 like really for me to be below that 250 bracket on that scale that would make me very happy so in any event I'll check in again in a couple of days uh, maybe even sooner depending on how my schedule goes so peace love blessings and deuces